With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello, everyone. The question is, which of the following is a correct statement? The statements are, anode rays arise from anode, so-called. Anode rays are also known as canal rays. The nature of anode rays depend upon the nature of gas in the discharge tube for all of this. So let us understand the answer. Now the first sentence, anode rays arise from anode. This is a correct statement. The German scientist named Goldstein, a German scientist, Goldstein, he conducted many experiments in gas discharge tubes in gas discharge tubes gas discharge tubes he found that a beam of rays were arising from the anode electrode that is from the positive electrode and they were the anode rays and anode rays they contain positively charged particles positively charged particles called protons. So therefore the first statement is correct. Now the second statement, anode rays are also called as canal rays even this is correct. Anode rays are also known as canal rays even this is correct because in this gas discharge tube an experiment was conducted through using a perforated cathode. That time these anode rays they pass through the perforated rays that's why it was called as canal rays also it is also correct. The third one the nature of anode rays depend upon the nature of gas in the discharge tube. This is also correct because it does depend upon the nature of gas. So all of these are correct statement. So answer is, answer is all of these. All the options are correct answer. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.